things that skaters do that just make sense. When we see skaters out in the wild, we can tell how good or bad they are at skating just by their ollie. So here are the three different types of ollies based off the skater's skill level, starting with beginner slash poser. This is this skater's first time ollieing, so they're probably gonna have a pretty wide stance for extra balance and their tail might not hit the ground, which will look something like this. They're also obviously not comfortable with ollieing, so they might go a little bit slow like this, and this kind of ollie can't really take you up a curb yet. And next up is the intermediate skater. This Skaters ollie will have their front foot further in because the closer in your foot is, the more space you have to drag and level it out. This makes for a higher, more confident ollie, and when a skater is more confident, they're gonna move a little faster when they do their ollies. This level of ollie could go up a curve. Next up is the advanced skater. This skater has their front foot even closer in so they can drag it up more and bring it super high in the air. This skater has done a lot of ollies and they're usually very confident in them, so they're gonna go super fast when they do this trick. And you can take this ollie up almost anything. And that is 